in our regular system, these are uh, basically all the numbers that will be 1 in mod 26. Um, some of them, as you can see, are prime. So in this case, this will not be helpful to our process, but however, take a look at 27. I can split it into 3 times 9, which means that 3 and 9 are inverses in mod 26. Or let's take uh, 105 as an example. We can um, split that into 5 and 21. Both of them are smaller than 26. Um, and in this case, their product is 105, which means that they are also um, inverses to each other. So in the case of using it, applying it to a fine cipher to make sure that all the um, codes are unique letters, all the um, inverses we're going to find are going to be numbers that are prime to 26. So that excludes all the um, even numbers um, as well as 13. So you only have to find the inverses of 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 15, etc, etc. So for the sake of decoding for a fine cipher, here are all the inverses that are most likely going to be on the test. If they give you anything larger than 26, you put it into mod 26, and then that should be falling into this list again. You can choose to memorize all this, or you can just find it on the spot um, by looking for a number uh, when multiplied by whatever number you have um, is going to be uh, 1 in mod 26. And here are all the um, products of the two numbers, and you can see 27 has a remainder of 1 when divided by 26, and so does 209, 391, and all the other numbers on the list. Um, and if you would like to try this method in any other numbers, you can definitely go ahead and do so. Um, 